Tracy James rejects speaking with Meghan at Jamaican red carpet event after seeing recording devices on Markle's dress. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have recently sparked speculation in the media industry with their presence at a Paramount Pictures event, and more interpreted as a subtle nudge to Netflix about their future collaborations. This strategic positioning comes as their contract with Netflix inked in 2020 following their departure from royal duties approaches its expiration. The Montecito couple's attendance at the premiere of the Bob Marley documentary One Love under the banner of Netflix's competitor has been seen as a pointed message. They were photographed smiling alongside Paramount and Nickelodeon CEO Brian Robbins, fueling rumours of potential negotiations with alternative platforms. However, a source close to an insider said that there'll be no deal between Meghan and Paramount and Nickelodeon. The photos at the film premiere earlier this year happened when Meghan Markle gate-crashed Paramount CEO Brian Robbins and his wife Tracy James, who were ready to pose on the red carpet. The Harkles butted into the picture. The source said that the CEO and Tracy James shunned Meghan when they found out a little recording device was there on Meghan's dress. Maybe that's why the CEO and wife didn't even talk to her on the carpet whilst posing. After they finished getting pictures, Meghan said something to the woman who ignored her completely and walked on. All stories with Meghan can be recorded. What a sad life this woman leads. Always trying to find something to sell or bribe by wearing recording devices. According to a clip from Entertainment Tonight, you can clearly hear a voice telling the photographers who they are, Paramount's CEO. Then out of nowhere, Harry and Meghan appear and awkwardly pose on the side, practically in the palm tree, as the exec and wife weren't budging to make room. Then Meghan put her arm around Tracy, who pulled her left arm as far as possible from touching Meghan. Brian just looked as far off in the other direction as Harry and Meghan as he could to show no association. Meghan for sure noticed the snub when she moved her arm away from her. She tried to make eye contact, maybe trying to warm her up, because she realised there were photos and videos taken of the snub, but the wife wouldn't acknowledge her. So cringe. When you see it as a still photo, it's not so bad, but when you see everyone in motion... Megan just bulldozed her way all up in Tracy James's personal space. She doesn't like anyone pushing her out of the limelight like at the variety event, but she can't wait for the couple ahead of her to finish their moment in the sun, so she butted in. The CEO really looked like he was pulling his wife away so they could avoid being photographed with the Harkles. He'd seen them coming and wanted to get out of there. Then the wife kind of gave him a look to say, Honey, we can't run away in front of the cameras. We have to do this photo. But yeah, She was very reluctant. Harry and Meghan probably already know Netflix is not renewing. Meghan's desperately trying to network. Flying 10 hours and leaving behind a sick child to see a movie.